Welcome to Dan Therm's Flexibox free cooling installation video. Flexibox is a free cooling system that is designed to cool telecom shelters and rooms through controlled ventilation via ambient air. This solution can be used instead of or in combination with an air conditioner. So what are the benefits to using a Flexibox? Flexibox will reduce your energy consumption, lower your energy costs, and lower your carbon footprint. Additionally, Flexibox will improve the airflow in the telecom shelter or room. When used with an existing air conditioner, a Flexibox will extend the lifetime of the AC system. Use of a Flexibox will also reduce service visits and maintenance costs. And a Flexibox system provides backup cooling in the event of a grid power failure. Flexibox systems can be installed at new or existing sites. They can be installed at a variety of shelter types, such as containers and rooms made of materials ranging from concrete, wood, corrugated metal, fiberglass, and brick. Today's installation will focus on Dantherm's Flexibox 450 Outdoor Curved Air System. This will be installed on an existing telecom shelter with a corrugated metal exterior in combination with an existing air conditioner. Here's an overview of the installation steps. Determine item placement. Unpack the Flexibox system. Install the fan box and rain hood. Install the damper and rain hood. Mount the controller, indoor sensor, and run wiring. Program controller and run self-test. Begin by reviewing the site and checking for interior and exterior obstructions prior to determining a location for the components. Additionally, make sure you refer to the pre-installation site survey as needed. Find the unobstructed airflow path for the fan unit. Make sure the location for the exhaust damper is placed as high as possible to the ceiling. Also, make sure that there is space for installation of the controller near the existing AC controller or communications board. Now you are ready to unpack the components and review the materials list. Make sure you inspect the materials for any damage, then locate the installation manual and read carefully. Please refer to the installation manual and the site survey for the mounting height of the fan box and fan box rain hood. Use the provided wall insert to trace the outline for the wall cutout. Proceed to cut an opening through the shelter wall and be careful to avoid any hidden obstructions behind the wall. Place the wall insert in the opening and seal any gaps. Then you'll need to run the wires through the opening and mount the fan box to the wall. Next, mount the outdoor temperature sensor above the fan box, then proceed to mount the fan box rain hood to the wall. Finally, check for any openings around the wall cutout and around the fan box and rain hood and seal as needed. You will essentially repeat the same process for the installation of the exhaust damper and exhaust damper rain hood. Take measurements and trace the outline for the wall cutout. Cut the opening and place the wall insert. Seal any gaps. Mount the exhaust damper and exhaust damper rain hood. Seal as needed. Now you're ready to mount the controller and sensor and run wiring. First, mount the controller to the wall near the existing AC controller or communications board. Using an IR thermometer, locate the hottest and highest spot in the shelter and mount the indoor temperature sensor. Next, you'll need to run all the wiring over the cable trays from the selected placement locations, including the exhaust damper, indoor temperature sensor, and the controller. Make sure you also zip tie any loose wiring to existing wiring on the cable trays and against the walls. Now strip the wires and then connect them to the input channels inside the controller. Please make sure you refer to the wiring diagram and installation manual for all wiring connections. Finally, secure the interior fan grill to the wall. Now we will power on the unit and proceed to run a self-test. Once the self-test runs properly, installation is complete and the Flexibox system is now ready for operation. Please remember to turn over the installation manual to the owner-operator or leave it on site for future reference. Dantherm Flexibox installations can be completed easily and efficiently if you follow these steps. Please contact us for more information about Flexibox and other Dantherm products and services. Thank you for watching.